instead of turning to Abdul Rahman now, I am going to deal with some business which remain unattended for a few days. I spoke of the verses of the Quran which happen to be in pairs and they strengthen each other. And I also categorically mentioned that hell is not forever and the heaven is most certainly forever. But some people who read the Quran cursorily, they find similar expressions with relation to heaven as well as with relation to hell. And they believe that both are unlimited. While the verses which apparently have similar expressions also contain indications that hell must come to an end, but heaven will not. Somewhere the indications are subtle and somewhere they are very apparent. So I have chosen some verses to indicate both these things. For instance, in Surah Yunus 26-28, أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم للذين آسن الحسن والزيادة ولا يرق وجوهم قطر ولا ذلة أولئك أصحاب الجنة هم فيها خالدون Again, the second verse speaking of the people who will be sent to Jahannam says Ulaik ashabu nar hum fiya khalidun so the similarity between khalidun Ulaik ashabu jannah hum fiya khalidun Ulaik ashabu nar hum fiya khalidun this superficial similarity misleads some people to believe that both will continue forever but in the first verse if you read it carefully, Lillazin Asunul Husna wa Ziyada. It means those who do good deeds, the other of that deed is theirs, and there is also more. But regarding Sayyya, the Holy Quran repeatedly says that people who commit Sayyya no more than the Sayyya will be the result of the Sahih will be granted them. <coughs> but there are other clearer word, verses which I am going to mention now. Surah Al-Kaf Zalika jazaahum jahannamu bima kafaru wa takhadu ayati wa rusuli hujwa inna lazeen amanu wa amanu salihadeh kanat lahum jannatul firdaus se nuzula خالدین فیہا لا یبغون عنہا حوالا This is about جنت The other verse is procedures regarding جہنم اولائک الذین کفروا بے آیات ربیم و لقائی فابتت عمالوم فلا نقیم لہم یوم القیامت وزنا It generally treats the people as people of Jahannam. You see, Pali verse me thina wo Jahannam. Wo kaan gaye jahannam. Zalika jazaohum Jahannam bima kafaru wa takhazu ayati wa rusuli hojwa. Fala nukhimu lahum yawm al qiyamat wazna. Here, no qualifying verse follows Jahannam which means that they will be there forever. ذَلِكَ جَزَاءُ جَهَنَّمْ بِمَا كَفَرُوا وَتَّخْذُوا آيَاتِ وَرُسُلِ حُضُوَا There is no qualifying clause indicating it's eternal. But in case of Jannat it says, إِنَّ لَذِينَ آمَنُوا وَمِلُوا صَلَحَاتِ كَانَتْ لَهُمْ جَنَّاتُ الْفِرْدَوْسِ نُزُلَا خَالِدِينَ فِيهَا لَا يَبْغُونَ عَنْهَا حِوَالَا They will never be turned away from it. It's going to be permanent. But about Jahannam, this is not mentioned. But more clear evidence is produced in other verses.
یوت خل ہو جناتین تجری من تحت الانہار و خالدین فیہا ابدا ذالک الفوز العظیم خالدین فیہا ابدا In the second verse it says وَالَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا وَكَذَّبُوا بِآیَاتِنَا اُلَائِكَ اَصْحَابُ النَّارِ خَالِدِينَ فِيهَا The word Abada is intentionally left out. Because it's not a man's writing. Allah when he omits something he does it always intentionally. To make a difference between the two verses. So Jannat our Khalidina fi Abada and with relation to Jannat and with relation to Jahannam it says Ulaika Sabunar Khalidina fi no more. Then the Holy Quran says Inna lazina kafaru min ahli kitabi wal mushrikina fi nari Jahannam Khalidina fi no abadan is mentioned Ulaika hum sharrul bariya about those who believe in the Lazi Namanu wa minu swalahati ulaika hum khairul bariya jazao hum in the rabbihim jannatu adnin tajri minta tiranar khalidina fiha abada radu allahu annum radu annum zalika limun khushya rabba so here khalidina fiha abada as against just khalidina fiha and the verse which I read before of Surah Hud that I don't want to repeat, but also I want to mention that in Surah Teen, the Holy Quran says, إِلَّا الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا وَآمِنُوا الصَّوَالِحَاتِ فَلَهُمْ أَجْرٌ غَيْرُ مَمْنُونَ They will be rewarded with a reward which will never be cut off. It is so clear that after that there is no room left for anybody to doubt that Jannat will be forever and Jahannam will be limited. Clear? Yeah? Yeah. Now I take leave of you because I have to attend a meeting with some people who have brought some props with them, you know, the Janada people. So in the meantime you can translate, right? Yes. Assalamu alaikum. Yes.